Hi everyone, welcome to Lapis Compass. Thank you so much for being here. Today we are doing a reading for Leo. This is going to be for the second half of January. I prepared several decks to use today. We're gonna look for different messages. Some messages are connected, some are separate. Please do keep in mind, Leo, not every message will resonate with every one of you, but your message can come through all the way in the end of the reading. So stick around and let's find out what's going on. Leo, second half of January, what's going on? We have a thinking man coming out here. Somebody's thinking about you. I get that very strongly. We have a thinking, well, look at that. Thinking man and thinking woman, honey, interesting. And just the top one, walking away. All right. These are your cards. Let's go ahead and start clarifying. Starting with that thinking man. <laughs> somebody is very interested in you. Somebody has their eye on you. Somebody is uh, thinking about you. And somebody is almost kind of spying on you here. I do feel there is somebody here who's watching your social media. I do feel there is somebody here that might be even... Uh, trying to you know pass by the same area where they think you might be and just uh, watch you from a distance i do get that energy could be um an air sign doesn't have to be i do get a masculine energy from this i must say so uh, i feel like this person wants um, uh, to start a relationship with you i do feel that this is somebody relatively new and i do see that this person is quite passionate about you they're very excited about you they're very excited to get to know you and it feels to me like this person wants an equal give and take they want an actual um relationship with you that will be very well very well balanced that's what i'm getting from this person let's go ahead and see what is this thinking woman whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Okay, let's see what we have. We have three of cups, ten of wands, three of pentacles, and queen of pentacles. Wow. Um, I get for a lot of you, Leos, that this is your energy. This is you thinking about something. This is you, for a lot of you, thinking about a leaving um, an environment, an environment where you used to work, possibly your, your old boss here, and walking away from it. I feel like this was a very challenging place to work. I do feel like... Um, what was challenging about this place is actually management. I feel like you had a lot of friends there and I feel like the people that you were working with, you actually got along really well with, but there was somebody in this um, organization, this place, in this office that was just giving you a lot of hard time. And it feels like a management uh, energy, it feels like a boss energy. It feels like somebody who's in charge. I feel like they were just putting a lot of work on you and not necessarily giving you the recognition and uh, the pay that you deserved. I feel like it was a very burdensome, uh, it's been a very burdensome for you. You're thinking of leaving that place. You're thinking about walking away. You're thinking of put, putting an end to it. Um, some of you are thinking about severance package. You're thinking, you know, uh, to negotiate a severance package here. And I do see you considering of walking away and uh, just going to work somewhere else that's what i'm getting from this interesting different messages not even connected okay let's find out what is this walking away what is that here for for leo hangman face of swords three of wands temperance Magician, look at all these major arcanas. Wow, okay. Now, somebody is definitely walking away from a relationship here. I see you walking away from a relationship, moving to the Kama Shores. This is something that was kind of on and off. This is what I'm getting here. It feels to me like uh, this was a relationship that was on and off, on and off. It felt stuck, then it was moving a little further, then you've been waiting for this person to make some... Um, Act, to take some actions to make some moves here and it just wasn't happening there is a bit of a reminiscing about the past but i feel like you already have a promise of a new energy there i feel like you you know you 
you know, very much aware of the past year and the spilled cups and the relationships that didn't work out that you're walking away from, but you are very hopeful and positive and optimistic about the new energy that is coming in for you. I feel like this is something that you are manifesting. I feel like this is something that you've been desiring and consciously or unconsciously bringing into your 3D life. But the hangman manage, uh, energy and uh, um, and a magician and um, temperance here, I feel like, like I said, you've been manifesting this into your life. You want some breakthrough. I feel like you've been stuck in the situation that you were in. I feel like the relationship was not moving um, further. It just wasn't progressing. And I do feel that you wanted a breakthrough. You've been waiting for something to happen and it just wasn't happening here. And you're deciding now to walk away. You're deciding to move to the common shores, move away from this, just completely start something new you're ready for a new beginning somewhere else that's what i see here there's a lot of signs that are coming out here um pisces energy could be significant sagittarius gemini aries those signs stand out to me that's what i see all right leo let's go ahead and move this out of the way let's pull some coffee cup oracle cards for you let's see what else comes through what do we need to know what's going on leo What's going on? What's going on? We have dolphins. Some of you are going for a nice concert. I see a music concert around you. So in the second half of January, some of you are definitely attending a, um, a, a musical concert. A concert that um, you'll be actually very, um, you'll have a great time there. I see that. And look at this. We have flowers and a bride. Lots of love around you, Leo. Lots of love. Let's get a little bit of clarification here. Oh, nice. We have Dad. We have Chariot. <laughs> Page of Wands. And Three of Wands. Let's get another one. Nine of Swords. Wow. Okay, some of you are definitely put an end to a difficult relationship. You almost came out like a, as a wounded warrior here. I do get this energy that some of you were uh, almost left um, after after um, after an offer of commitment. That's what I'm trying to say. So you could have been engaged to somebody and uh, the engagements fall, uh, engagement fell through. I get that energy here. I do get an ending. There is an ending here of a relationship. And I feel like uh, you've been trying to move on from this. You've been trying to heal from this. And uh, in the second half of January, you're going to open up yourself to a little bit more of social life here. And it's going to bring what you've been waiting for. I do get that there is a progression in your love life. I do get that there is more people around you that... Um, and will be paying attention to you there is definitely romance coming in there is new love that is coming in for you that has a potential to become a, a very committed relationship i do see uh, that um, this is something that is some, uh, you've been waiting for for a long time it almost feels to me like um, the relationship where you have been it almost feels like it was a very long engagement but it never really became a marriage you never actually got married to this person that's the energy i'm getting here and you're deciding to put an end to it you you are done with that you're done waiting for this person here and i feel like you, like i said you've been opening up yourself you're going to spend a little bit more time with your friends out socializing here and you're going to invite more romance into your life this is what i see happening for you scorpio cancer stand out your energy of a fire sign is very, very, very strong here. You're in much better, more hopeful, much more positive and fun mood in this second half of January. That's what I see for you. All right, let's see what else comes up. Let's pull some coffee. Um, no, let's do some uh, kipper cards. We've done the coffee cup. Let's do some kipper for you. Let's see what else is here for you. This way, this way, and main female. For some of you, there is some. Uh, um, 
there is uh, there is some situation that you will, deal, will be dealing uh, with for some of you when it comes to um, parental issues and it's not necessarily parental issues as in issues with your child what I'm getting here is um, uh, for separated for separated Leo's here I do get you dealing with uh, uh, support child support here this kind of situations can come through here I do feel that uh, for some of you uh, you will be actually getting um, the child support that you that you expected here I do feel that um, you will be getting the uh, um, the money, the support that uh, was meant to be given to you for a while, maybe there's something that wasn't uh, wasn't paid, wasn't paid correctly, wasn't paid at all. I feel like you're going to be getting this. Uh, there is some sort of breakthrough here where there's a once, king of once. This is your energy here. Ten of once has been burdensome. I feel like. Um, um, like I said, this is for those leaves who are separated and there is a child involved here. I feel like uh, you've been carrying all the weight. You've been carrying all the uh, financial responsibilities when it comes to this situation. You've been paying all the bills. You've been, you know, taking care of the child and you and, every, and the household here. And the other person wasn't... Uh, paying in that's what i'm getting here i feel that situation is changing the moon there is a light brought up on this situation i feel like um, there will be some decisions made here and uh, there will be some very um, stern decisions made here where you will actually uh, be given what you deserve here and you know in financial matters in financial matters so basically if you have some sort of custody situation going on um, if you have some sort of financial support that is owned to you, I see that being paid to you. That's what's coming up. Interesting. Okay. All right. <laughs> well, these are the messages that came through for you today, Leo. Um, a little bit specific, a little bit different. Please do take what resonates and leave the rest for others. And I thank you so much for spending your time with me. I hope this reading was helpful and talk to you soon. Bye for now.